Hey everybody, welcome back to another fantastic episode here at Title Tuesdays. My name is Kevin Thatcher, the founder and CEO, also known as your Title King. Don't forget to subscribe below. I say it every week. It's the only way you're going to get notification of our next upcoming episode. Today's episode is going to be a quick one because we just got done speaking at a local convention. And one of the largest questions we get asked is, do we need an attorney to represent us in a real estate closing? And I want to tell you that these questions usually come from people that are coming from other states where it's very heavily attorney driven for the title insurance industry. You usually are required to have an attorney. I know up in New York, when my parents sold their house, they had a title company that did the real estate closing and they had an attorney that drafted the contract, reviewed the documents and helped facilitate the closing. So what I wanna tell you is that here in the state of Florida, the real estate contract that most people are using is the FAR bar contract. That FAR bar contract was drafted by attorneys and realtors here in South Florida and in North Florida to help facilitate a real estate closing. It allows a real estate agent to produce a contract fill in the blanks, add a couple of things here and there, and now these buyers and sellers are bound to the contract. So the question is, do I need an attorney to do a closing? Well, it depends. One of the things that I always like to say is, I look at the difference between a title company and a real estate attorney. And one of the things you have to remember, as we talked about in previous videos, is that title insurance is customer service driven. So if you're hiring a title company that has an attorney, that attorney really should not be representing you, they should be representing the transaction. So if you'd like, uh, what I would suggest is to hire a real estate attorney if you feel most comfortable, but you wanna hire one that does not own the title company. Because in the state of Florida, the title insurance company, as with Independence Title, we act as an independent third party. So my obligation is to look out for the buyer, the seller, the realtors, the lenders, make sure everyone's protected and we're able to deliver clear and marketable title to that buyer and to that lender. So it's very, very important for me to not have that interest in the transaction where I'm representing one party or the next. We look out for everyone. So that's really my tip because here in the state of Florida, a lot of times we see attorneys get involved in closings when something needs to be done, whether documents need to be drafted, uh, certain things need to be done on a transaction, there's a dispute for escrow, uh, a trust needs to be created in order to put a property into some type of revocable trust or a Florida land trust, that's when we get attorneys involved. And at Independence Title, we have a team of attorneys that we can introduce our buyers to that do not own the title company, that if they need some type of legal services, whether it's probate, we have a probate attorney. If it's contract dispute, we have a separate attorney that handles contract dispute. If it's a title insurance claim matter, we have an attorney that specifically specializes in handling title insurance claims. So depending on what the issue is, is what I always tell people, I would love to introduce you to one of the attorneys that I have on our team so we can make sure we get you to the right person that is going to solve your problem, not an attorney that is a jack of all trades and they can do all different types of law. We wanna make sure what you're specifically looking for, we're able to introduce you to, so this way we know the deal's gonna close it's gonna close on time, every time, without any issues. So I hope that kind of answered your question today when we're talking about do you need a title company, do you need an attorney, and what are the differences? Attorneys play a very important role in a real estate closing when they're needed but I always look for the customer service from a title company to make sure that they have enough people to deliver that level of customer service. Someone's on vacation, someone else can step in and take care of your file. You need to do a closing an hour or two away, someone's able to leave for the day to go do that closing and get it taken care of. So you wanna vet the title company, not necessarily the attorney. Vet the title company, make sure it's the right fit, and then ask them, do you have an attorney that you've used in the past that can help me with this? If it's contract review, great. I have an excellent attorney that handles contracts, whether it's business or real estate contracts. If there are ones that represent clients for association work, when in a, where a buyer may have been declined or, or thinking about issues with a homeowner's association, I have a great association attorney. So that's my story for today. I wanna let you know that we have a team of attorneys that are willing to help you on your next real estate closing should we need to get one involved. So as always, Kevin Thatcher, the owner here at Independence Title, and I look forward to seeing you at the closing table.